Hello and welcome back to another Python challenge. My name's Tom with Master Code Online. In today's tutorial, we're going to go ahead and ask that um, when you're given a string, uh, you make it title case. And what title case means is, uh, for example, if I if you're given a word Thomas Myers like this, it should be returned to us as Thomas Myers like that. All right. So basically, what we're asking that you do is you take an input all right so we're going to input some kind of string into a function and i want you to go ahead and return that function to us with title case all right and only the first letter of each word should be capitalized with that being said let's go ahead and take a look at our example so i'm going to put in thomas myers like that and it returns thomas myers in title case Here's another example. We're going to do uh, master code on nine like this, and it returns master code online. Now, here's another example. If I do, um, uh, let's run the program again 2019 new year like this. Notice that this is one word. All right, it's the ugliest thing you'd ever see. We would never write it like that. And this is a new word. But. With that being said, we want to, we're challenging you here. We're throwing you a little curveball. So we hit return and notice it says 2019 new year. Notice is not capitalized. That's what we're looking for. We do not want to capitalize that because in theory, this should have been capitalized, but we can't capitalize a number. So let's go ahead and write this program. Now, the easiest solution that comes to mind for me is hey why not use the title method so let's go ahead and write this program and figure out if the title method is going to work for us all right so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to define a function so we'll go ahead and uh, define a function called solve and that's going to take one parameter and that's going to be s we're going to return a uh, s dot title like this and we'll go ahead and get the input we'll name this uh, variable s and then we'll do input and it will call this um, function and pass in s as the argument we'll go ahead and save that let's go back and run our little program here and we'll do python so uh, python 3 sorry solution.py now the cursor's down here we should probably write a prompt but i didn't um, we'll go ahead and put in uh, hello world like this and we'll see what happens nothing well the reason nothing happened here was because we didn't print it print the function out so we'll do print like that and print here we'll save that and we'll go ahead and run that again and we'll do hello world like that hit return and notice i get hello world all right cool that's what we wanted but remember i said we we're going to throw you a little curveball. Let's go ahead and look at another one. Let's do the 2019 new year like that. And notice the 2019 and then new is capitalized or the N in new is capitalized. <coughs> and then year. I said we didn't want it capitalized because in theory this should have been capitalized. How do we fix that issue? Now I hope you guys figured this out. But there's a um the title method is not going to work for us so we're going to go ahead and get rid of the title method we're going to bring in the string module we're going to say import uh string all right there is a string module if you're not aware of that and we're going to say string dot cap words all right so this will capitalize words based off of what our parameter we pass so we're going to say s we're going to pass s in since that is our argument here and then we're just going to say hey separate on the space all right so separate on white space when it approaches a white space and it crosses over a white space the next letter of that word will be capitalized all right now let's go ahead and save that and run our program again and pass in our test it was 2019 new year like that and notice we get 2019 new n in new is lowercase and then year basically since we didn't pass a white space it makes this 
lowercase. If you guys have any questions, please let me know. If you have a better solution, please let us know. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next challenge tomorrow.